Hey everyone, happy Saturday, June 18th. Today's my mom's birthday. Happy birthday, mommy. Hope you're having a good day. So, today is June 18th, and please disregard the background. It's a hot mess, and I am unashamed because <laughs> I'm focused right now. But, um, so we, we are, oh goodness, we are, get, we are getting ready for Dad's Father's Day surprise, y'all. Yeah, my dad. Your dad's what? Father's Day present. And it's right here. Guys, make sure okay, to subscribe, okay. like for this channel. And we are going to get this ready yeah yeah okay so currently we're in dad's office and his office is very bare it's very just it's just like uh, it's very plain it's right just like, eh. yeah, it's just eh. it's eh. so so we have the dog's crates right here mm -hmm. and he has a little drawer desk thingy where he keeps all his stuff mm-hmm and we have a little game called Go, Go Fish. Go Fish. Yeah, I say goldfish too. My where, where do you get this game? I don't know. I don't know where we got it from. Well, you can find it at any store probably. Just make sure to check and don't leave us hanging. Like, go in the comments down below. Is that your computer making that noise? Oh. oh, okay. All right, let me go ahead and talk to them, okay? Okay. Okay, so first before we get started, I'm going to tell you what we've been doing. Yeah. So last night I stayed up and did three heads. I still got this head to do, but I didn't get to it because it was 2 o'clock and I had just finished her hair. I did both of the boys' hair, right. deep condition, everything, trim a little bit everything the whole nine and then I finished her I did the boys hair first while her hair was deep conditioning like for hours and hours um, and then um, then I blow dried her hair and put in those two braids so now I'm tired we got up I woke up at like 6 37 then cleaned up the house I didn't record anything because I was really focused on getting done um, and it's it's a mess it's not a mess but it is because i went in that closet under the stairs and i found some stuff that didn't need to be in there so i moved it out into the open so that i can get rid of it um yeah, yeah right yeah so i'm just basically playing some roblox well yeah you're about to you need me to do the password for you yeah yeah guys um, so if you want to know how to do the Robux thingy, so you just go on um, Roblox.com and then um, type in your um, your password to your Roblox account, and then you type in your Roblox account. Okay, guys. So make sure to go and see how that goes, and check out that channel, cause we're about to do it. Okay, baby. <laughs> So, what was I saying? I need coffee. So we went. Um, you do not need coffee. You so, need. You need water. So, anyways, what was I was saying we went to her basketball game. She did good. Now we're back home. I bought. I bought these things. Okay, actually, let me back up a little bit. I'm going too far ahead. So let me give you all a room tour so you can understand what's going on in his office. Mm -hmm. And then understand the vision. So pretty much we're gonna piece by piece. We're not we're not getting a whole bunch of stuff all at once. We we're not we ain't made of money. So we gotta put together what we can. The man who fell to earth. It's interesting looking. This is what I'm looking at here. Alright, so alright. So now we'll do the room tour. Okay, let's go. So here, this is actually a bedroom. This is the second largest bedroom in the house. Yeah, yeah, this is the second largest bedroom in the house. Yeah, but dad, my dad changed it into a office for some reason. Yeah, this is his office. 
Um, so it was supposed to be the guest bedroom, and it can be. So he does have a closet. Um, the closet is nothing like it's just junk in here. So <laughs> I'm not touching this. This this is not anything I'm gonna be doing anything with. Yeah, I don't understand why we have two PlayStations. That is crazy. That is insane. And then I don't know whose laptop. I don't know whose laptop that is. Okay, anyways. Alright, so then we walk in here. These are the bookshelves that I bought. These are $25 at Target. So, he has his Bible and his study Bible here. Um, this I'm actually selling on Facebook Marketplace, but no one has come to buy it. So... And probably lower the price. I put it 50, but I thought people would actually like try to get it, but they haven't. So I'm gonna probably just lower it down to 25. I really just want it to be gone, kind of, because um, it it doesn't really serve too much of a purpose. It's just off in the corner. <laughs> so, anyways, here we go. We got the dogs' crates. Now this is the part I hate. I really hate the dogs being in here because they're hairy and they're nasty and just whatever but there's honestly yeah, nowhere else and sometimes it's muddy outside and we leave them outside and they come in with muddy feet actually can you go let the dogs in i forgot thank you baby so there's nowhere else in the house where these dogs can go this is honestly the only place so this is their crates so we have these chairs these are actually a gift from my grandmother um i am going to be getting him new chairs after we paint his office, I really want to paint it like a dark color. I'm obsessed with dark colors for some reason. But it's whatever color he wants. And I found these cognac colored chairs. They're so beautiful. They're so beautiful. But they'll actually go over here. Because what happens is the dogs will see, hear somebody at the door. Go, try to see what's going on. And they'll climb on these chairs. Yeah. Oh no! You hit me a paper towel, baby. So the dogs climb up on this and I hate, I absolutely hate that. So what I want to do is put the chairs over here where if they're in here, there's no reason for them to climb because they're going to be nice chairs. They're going to be really, really nice. Um, well, not like they're from Walmart. <laughs> so however nice you think that is, but they're nice looking and they recline and everything, which is what he really wants. So these will be going, they're actually way, they're, these are too big for the space. They're too big for my house in general. Like if I was to have them in the living room, that'd be different. But because the, they're in a room, they just, they take up a lot of space. Um, yeah, you can't like run in here. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So then over here we have his desk. So this is the area we're really focusing on. Now if you can see, I don't know if you can tell really well on camera. But one of these is um, not level. It's either the TV or it's the yes. the um, shelf. And I think the shelf is uh, level. I think the TV is not level. And I can't turn it. I can't, you know, like, I can't fix it. Like, it's not one that'll, like, turn this way or anything. So we're kind of stuck with that because I don't want to make the shelf unlevel <laughs> to match the TV. So we'll leave it like that for now. And what all we're going to be doing is putting some bookshelves right here. I got him two bookshelves. They'll slide. They'll fit perfectly in between here. I have to move this over just a tad, um, like maybe half an inch. But the, the trash can will stay back there because he can still get to it. And we'll just have the shelf the bookshelf start maybe like right here and then come out and it's gonna be two of them both of them put together about 51 inches long and I measured and that'll stop like about here I'm so excited about it it's gonna look so good and that it's black um, and so I figured worst case scenario even if he doesn't want to keep that set up he could still use it somewhere else so eventually th like this is gonna be his man cave um, you know God willing, of course. So his chairs will be over here. Okay. Then over here, I'm thinking he'll have like a little bar area. So he can have a built like a fridge and a cabinet. And then he can have a little top if he wants. Or he can have like some grand, some grand, like super tall, super tall um, 
bookshelves like the Etegri, Etegri or whatever, Etegre, whatever that's or called. Or he can have like a short bookshelf like that goes all the way to his height. Mm-hmm. Or I could, I could get these and then just stack them on top of each other all the way up to the ceiling. And then, you know, that could be that. So the possibilities are endless in this room. But just the way that you walk into this room, it feels really nice. So he, he, he has a really good room here. Turn this light off. So now we will get started. So we're going to be putting the bookshelves right here, like I said. And then I'll be un unboxing. So let me tell you all what I got. I've been talking for 15 minutes. Um, I got him a PlayStation 5. And yeah, I'm, he wanted it. He wanted it, and I'm so excited. I'm like, y'all don't understand. My man works hard. He he works a lot. Um, he gives a lot. He sacrifices a lot, and I'm just very grateful. So if if I know he he really wants something, he's not gonna get it. Like he's just he's just not going to. Or sometimes he does, but he'll. I don't know. I don't know how to describe it, but he's just very humble and very, um, very much focused on other people and other things rather than himself. And so for that reason, um, I went ahead and got this thanks to my mom. She helped me out with getting it. And I'm just so happy that, you know, it's something that he can have for himself because he deserves it. He really does. So we're going to get it. It's in this little dungeon area. It's back here. So I gotta go into the the lair. Ooh. And I was kind of thinking. Do you think Dad should open? I should let Dad open the box himself. So I should not open it and set it up for him. Oh yeah. Okay. Let him open it, right? No. You should set it up for him. I should set it up? Yes. So it, so it can be a surprise. Well, what if he gets to open the box? And he thinks that the bookshelves are his surprise, but really what's in the box is his surprise. Oh yeah. Let's, let's. You want to do that? Huh? And we can make him a bow. This my coffee. It's so good. All right. Put my phone up here on the charger. Oh, and also another reason no, why I just why I decided to put it over here was because it'll be a lot more convenient to get from the TV to down here. And then a lot of these things I can move. Cause look at that shelf. That shelf is, it is not, it is not aesthetically pleasing <laughs> at all. Like it's just, it's a lot on there. So I'm a uh, get his little space set up. There we go. I had to use his charger for my phone. But get his little space set up. His his mom got him these. I'm. I don't, he told me how he wanted them, but I don't remember. So I'm probably not going to touch those. I'm going to let him do it. And then probably move this, this picture. I just said that there with some little sticky tacks because I didn't want to push through. That's like a vintage 
it's some some picture he got from a card shop so um he likes it i like it so if he likes it i like it that's what i meant to say and his desk is all messy 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 so yeah and so oh what i was saying the the bookshelves come a little bit higher so they're gonna be about five inches higher which to me is fine um actually it'll be nice because he can then move his computer screen over to that side and then it'll be at a little a different level um i did not like that it was over here it just it just looks like it's overcrowded so he can have more because he is right-handed so he can have more space right here for his mouse you know why this is here um he can have more space for his mouse have his computer screen over there and it'll just it'll just add more like almost like it's an l-shaped desk but not you know and it'll, it'll just be nice so the vision will come together it's fine that it's black and this is brown it's, it's just gonna look really nice so what? let's get started what is that
Ja, dat mag ik Yeah. If you don't, I will. And if I don't, she will. Do you come on again? No. I, I want to do it. I tried to look for one. I couldn't find. I don't know what you want. Jaya, Jaya, girl. Here it is. Thank you, Dad. Thank you. Okay, y'all. So this is actually a week, almost a week later from when y'all saw the last footage but i wanted to give y'all just a tiny little tour keep in mind this isn't much but we're we're just gonna take small steps like i said i ain't made of money i can't just go and buy up him a whole new room right now we're, we got goals and focuses but it's the small things as long as he appreciates it that's what's most important to me so um he did actually move the um bookshelves down i don't know if this was the original spot or not but he moved them off the wall that's why there's this space right here they're not as flush because this fell or no this fell behind it so um he had to unscrew it to get to the picture and he didn't screw it back um so we're i guess we're just gonna leave it like that to make sure he likes this positioning um so he i put his little what's it called Amanda's little helper globe. He's had this for a couple years and it's so cute. Um, I have his Amazon remote. I did have this up on the wall, but I had it Velcro like this was, but it, it came off. So now it's just free floating. There's nothing on the other. Oh, yes, there is. <laughs> um, this shelf, he has two Nintendo games and then the switch like little dock thing nothing on the bottom shelf um he has his bible and a study bible a book that he's been reading and um that's perfect for father's day um so he has his i don't think this is the final um like place for all this stuff because he just has it just sitting there um but he has his little wall art um switch is right there um, um and then here's his playstation so we were going to put it right here. We still are. Well, let me say he still is. We have to get a longer HDMI cord that can actually reach. This one is like maybe three inches too short. So um, the cords will be a lot better. And I am still interested in getting like the behind the wall drop down so that I can just. Because I'm, I'm the cord person. I hate cords. Um, so he has his. I just put that there. Um, his playstation controller he only has one right now of course because we just got it and we didn't know that the old we have a whole bunch upstairs ps4 chargers but we didn't know that they didn't work with this one um and then his headphones that he uses for his computer sometimes um he still has his desk oh that's a card he put that there so i'm not gonna mess with it um he has his mouse he has his computer it's dusty it, it's dusty up in this room y'all i gotta get these dogs out of here his little charger. This is a really cute lamp. I actually bought this a couple months ago. It, I got it from Ross. It was like $10. But it's a light with a really nice Edison bulb. Um, and then it's a wax warmer on top. So you just put the wax cubes on top. And it just makes the room smell amazing. And so I really like it. And then, of course, his big old monitor. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. This one's kind of all over the place. But I'm trying to get out of the... The mindset that it has to be exactly perfect so um these are gonna my videos are more so gonna be more day in the life vlogs or videos maybe not vlogs but more day in the life videos um and as i get more comfortable with it and getting more into a routine um then I, i'll start like incorporating more types of footages like um out and about on the weekends and stuff like that but how was y'all's father's day uh let me know down below what your father's day was like did y'all do anything did you cook 
what y'all do i'm just interested in seeing what other people did maybe i'll have some ideas for next year um so yeah thank y'all so much for clicking on this video if you liked it please hit that like button and then don't forget to subscribe to the channel so you can see more content like this i'll see y'all in the next one bye